The final step in this setup is intonation. Intonation is basically a calibration of the string to itself so that it remains in tune over the entire range of the neck. And the way you do that is uh, by using the tuner is compare the frequency of the tone between fretting at the 12th fret and the harmonic at the 12th fret. And if there's a difference, then you're going to want to adjust string length depending on um, the relationship between the two tones. If the fretted note is sharp, then you're going to want to lengthen the string. Then you lengthen it just by simply tightening the screw here to move the saddle back. If the fretted note is instead flat, then you're going to want to shorten the string. In that case, you would loosen up the screw to move the saddle forward. One note is if you do want to move the saddle forward, you loosen the screw. Sometimes just because the string pressure pulling it down doesn't actually move it, so it's always a good idea to give the, um, the back of the screwdriver a little tap to make sure that you have pushed the saddle forward. Okay, with that said, we have to tune again like we always do, so let's just take a quick check. We're going to use the first string this time, and we're going to want to compare the fretted note to the harmonic. Okay, so what I'm observing is the fretted note is sharp. As a result, what we need to do is lengthen the string slightly. So we're going to go get the screwdriver, tighten the screw at the back of the bridge plate to move the saddle back. Okay, that should probably do it. And then check tuning again. This will have a big effect on tuning. Okay, it's a little better, but there's still a slight difference. The fretted note's still just a hair sharp. Retune. That's good. So just repeat the exact same process on the other five strings, and then you've got a well-intonated guitar. So that's the basic setup process. Uh, hopefully by now you'll agree there's no rocket science to it. Um, you just need a little bit of knowledge, right set of tools. And um, as a guitar player, it's uh, setup is something you can and should do. Keep your guitar in top playing shape. So become your own tech and um, have a dedicated toolkit and always have your guitar in top condition. Thanks very much. Mm -hmm.